Hello, welcome to the Humanities Faculty. This video is going to tell you a little bit about the options that we have for pupils going into S3 and S4 and also for pupils going into S5 and S6. In the Humanities Faculty we have four subjects which are Modern Studies, History, Geography and RNPS. Most people take at least one of these subjects in S3 and S4, with many, many pupils also taking two, and many people taking them on to higher and advanced higher level. In S3 and S4 Modern Studies, pupils will have the chance to study national level courses um, at National 3, 4 or 5. They'll study the topics of crime and law, democracy in Scotland, and they'll also look at a world power, which is the USA. Pupils will develop their skills in using sources to support and oppose arguments to make a decision and they'll also use them to come to conclusions. And they'll have the opportunity to go on some trips out of school such as to the Scottish Parliament in Edinburgh and also to Paisley Sheriff Court. In S5 and S6 pupils can take modern studies at higher level and in S6 to two advanced higher level as well. At higher, pupils cover the topics of social inequality, they also look at the USA and they look at democracy in Scotland and the United Kingdom. At advanced higher level, pupils study crime and law and they look in detail at research methods as well as completing a 5,000 word dissertation on a topic of their choice. Pupils will also have the opportunity to visit the UK Parliament as part of these courses. There are many career pathways related to the subject of modern studies, but just three of them are law, the police and the civil service. In history and S3 and S4, pupils will also follow the national course at level 3, 4 or 5. They'll study the topics of the Atlantic slave trade, the wars of independence, and also study Hitler and Nazi Germany. They develop many skills in history, including comparing historical sources and evaluating how useful they are. And they may have the chance to visit the Wallace Monument in Stirling as part of their studies. In S5 and S6, pupils have the chance to study higher history and in S6, they also have the chance to study advanced higher history as well. At higher level, pupils study three topics, British history, European and Scottish history as well. And at advanced higher level, pupils focus on the topic of Weimar and Nazi Germany, as well as completing a 4,000 word dissertation. The subject of history lends itself to many different career pathways, just some of which are teaching, journalism and working in the museum sector. In geography, pupils can achieve a national qualification at level 3, 4 or 5. They'll study physical geography topics such as glaciation and coasts. They'll also look at human geography topics such as population and a study of urban and rural areas. 
pupils will also study two highly relevant global issues, which are climate change and environmental hazards. Throughout the course, pupils will develop their skills in using maps and in analysing numerical sources of information, such as graphs and tables. Pupils may also have the chance to visit Dynamic Curve in Edinburgh, um, as well as take part in field trips. In S5 and S6, pupils have the chance to take geography at higher level, where they will study three topics. They'll look at physical geography, looking at the topics of atmosphere, hydrosphere, lithosphere and biosphere. They'll look at human geography, looking at the topics of rural land degradation and management, as well as urban change and management. And they'll also look at global issues such as development and health and global climate change. As part of the higher course, pupils also have an opportunity to go on a field trip to River Allender to develop their fieldwork skills. Geography lends itself to many different career pathways, three of which are working in the tourism industry, working in time planning and also surveying. In S3 and S4, in RMPS, pupils will have the chance to study religious, moral and philosophical topics such as the issues of morality and justice, the problem of evil and suffering and the world religion of Islam. Pupils will develop skills in how to analyse arguments and different viewpoints as well as how to evaluate evidence they are given. In S5 and S6, pupils have the chance to study RMPS at a higher level and it's a particularly popular course amongst pupils in S6 who take it as a crash hire. Pupils study in depth the topics of medical ethics, also look at the world religion of Buddhism and they look at the question of the existence of God. During their time in the course they have the opportunity to visit a place of worship and they'll also attend an ethics conference at Kelvin Side Academy. As with all the other subjects in the Humanities Faculty, RMPS lends itself to a number of different career pathways, three of which are a career in medicine, journalism and working in the charity sector. In S5 and S6, pupils also have the chance to take Scottish Studies and or Travel and Tourism. Scottish Studies is a new course that combines elements of modern studies, geography and history, where pupils focus on those subjects by studying them in a Scottish context. This course has no exam, it's purely coursework based and pupils also have to develop a research project on a Scottish topic of their choice. Travel and Tourism is a vocational course that aims to develop skills that help pupils in the workplace. It focuses on tourism in a Scottish context but also within the UK and worldwide and looks at the impact of tourism on our society and our wider life. Again, Travel and Tourism has no exam at the end and is purely coursework based. Thanks for listening. If you have any questions, please feel free to use this email address to get in touch.